All right, we're gonna fess up about a little something. The Oregon coast in summertime is magical. I don't know, I think it's kind of magical all times of year, but for different reasons. <laughs> yeah. Different times, different reasons. Yeah. But when you go to the Oregon coast in summer, well, you don't usually need as many layers for starters. Yeah. <laughs> Every once in a while you get just that perfect day where it's sunny and it's nice and it's not too windy, it's not too cold, it's not too hot, it's just right. And I think we just always feel really lucky when we get a coast today like that. And this was one of those days. Yeah. We are the learners and makers. So I think we were just feeling a real big need to like get out to the ocean. Our children needed to commune with waves. Yeah, Connor in particular, oh just gosh, he geez. loves the ocean. And um, we do have to be a little strategic about when we go because there is just no keeping this kid out of the water. We went um, to the same spot that we went in our other coast video and just had a really wonderful day splashing in the waves playing on the rock And I got to dip my toes into the water, which felt really, really great. I wore a special waterproof sock, which was really nice to help protect my prosthetic leg. And I, I don't know, having that water on my toes oh, was yeah. really special. It had... I don't even remember the last time that I could just be walking along on the beach and and do that. And not have to worry about your feet getting wet. Yeah. One of the things I really love about when we go to the coast here, when we go to the beach on the East Coast, either way, since it's this now and again thing, the kids always do something different. It's one of these ways you can just see the changes in them as they grow 
physically, as their minds develop, as their hearts get bigger. This time for me, something that really stuck out is, you know, the Oregon coast, we know it's lava. It's all a bunch of lava. And where we were, there are these amazing uh, lava cliffs. And some of it, you can kind of boulder up part of it. And both kids just scrambled up this little stretch of rock. <laughs> I love these moments because we focus really hard on talking to the kids about trusting themselves. It's like, yeah, hear us, definitely, but ultimately, trust your instincts, trust your heart, trust your mind, and you will find your way. We've continued to work on our camper, and this time we put in a new floor. And the cabinets made such a big difference, but I have to say, the floor, like... Well, the, the floor just felt more, stylistically, it felt more us, felt more current. And, and it's just nicer looking. And, like, we, we didn't, we left the old floor, we just gave it a good clean, and Jody had gotten some stick-on, like, you know, vinyl Planks. tiles, plank things. And I made sure she had coffee and water and got out of her way. Okay, we're ready for another day. We finished up the painting last night, and today is the floor. Well, we have some more adventures planned for the summer. We can't wait to show you as we are exploring some more of Oregon close to us. You can follow our adventures here on YouTube by subscribing to our channel and be sure you ding the bell so you get notified of all our new videos. You can also follow our everyday adventures on Instagram at learners and makers. We'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> it's going to be like, what Anthony dance is happening this week? <laughs> All right, go turn it off.